hi guys what is up welcome back to my channel today is a very special plan with me video since today we're going to be setting up my birth month that is right there was a beautiful baby born on the month of august and that is moi <laughs> anyways jokes aside august is my favorite set up with me video since it's going to be a bit of a throwback back to the time where princesses rule the earth char just like last year's plan with me i did a retro theme so if you would want to check that video out link is at the upper right For the month of August, I wanted it to become a series of us going back to time. Since every August I'll be adding up another year, might as well appreciate and take a step back of the things that happened in the past. So with that said, grab your pens, your journals, and a cup of tea, and let's get started. At first, I was going for a renaissance theme, but it felt kind of difficult and to avoid the group of people saying that I'm a noob for creating or drawing in the wrong column, I just made it seem like a classical vintage look. For my cover page, I drew in a princess with brown skin because I wanted it to somewhat look like me. A crown that represents being independent and some flowers growing outwards, which mainly represents growth. This page may look like it's all over the place, but if you really try to look, look into it and understand it piece by piece, it can really mean different things for different people. This time, I went for a more clean look, but still with all my aesthetics in one page. I will also be adding in a quote that I found on Pinterest by Morgan Harper Nicole, and it reads, Beneath the thoughts of feelings you have worn on your shoulders for so long, there is the real you. Who is worthy of freedom from the darkness said you would be for you are more than what you think and yes these things do matter but they do not mean everything there is still endless grace to let those old things go and start all over again it's a really moving quote that represents self-growth or self-acceptance which i feel like is the mood that I'm going for for this page. Now moving on to my monthly spread, the layout is the same with last month but having three columns on both sides and at the middle. As you can see, I searched for the renaissance column design because I did want it to be specific with the theme and to try not to make any errors but later on I felt that it's too difficult so 
I opted for a simpler solution for the sake of myself and you guys. I like the color coding that I did last month, which is why I recreated it for this month. To be honest, I feel like this spread is a little too dark for my taste, so don't be shocked if by the end of the month there would be changes for this spread. Next is my new things a day page that hopefully some of you guys started as well. I did a collage at the left with photos that I downloaded online. I also dedicated a Pinterest board just for this page so if you guys would like to check it out, link will be down below. This spread will be really helpful for this month since I do want to introduce myself with new things. Just like last year, I realized that I can walk to my office within 30 to 40 minutes. It will save me money and decrease my carbon footprint. So again, if you can, please do try this spread. For my mood jacker, and I feel like this is my favorite spread so far, and the one that took the most time making, I thought of creating a tiara that would later on be filled with different colors that would imitate gems and that would represent my overall mood for each day. In time, I would like a tiara just like this one, but for now, my bullet journal will do.
that's pretty much it for all the main spreads for this digital journal. Here are two weekly spread ideas for you guys. Um, this is basically what my weekly spreads would look like. I really like how it turned out since it really blends in with the theme for the month. And of course, as always, if you ever recreated any of these spreads, make sure to tag me on Instagram or add in the hashtag Eunice Corner so I would be able to check it out. For sure, any of your creations would turn out really lovely and it would give me the assurance that I am somewhat helpful for your pages or your spreads. I also added in a well my favorite spreads and and dami ah, favorite spreads <laughs> my favorite spread and the memories page for my august <laughs> and that's pretty much it for this video this might have been a long one but i do hope that you guys like it let me know in the comments down below your favorite spread and what videos would you want to see in the future again thank you guys for watching don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and the red subscribe button to see more videos from me bye guys